this edition of Performance TV, imagine this, installed in this. Not such a big stretch when you consider this monster AC motor powering your electric golf cart. Because as always, things are looking up on Performance TV, presented by Topcoat, next. This is Performance TV presented by Topcoat. I am Dave Dobson filling in for Kathy and Joe. Now, of course, it's called Performance TV and we've got some golf carts here. So what's the deal with performance? Well, let me tell you. First of all, Travis, you're responsible for this monster build here. You're with Golf Carts Modified. That's your company. But the real secret and the thing we're going to talk about is what's underneath here, what makes it go. Tell us what Navitas does to soup these things up. So everything on the cart is powered by Navitas controllers. Um, Navitas offers a wide range of products when you want to speed up your cart and increase speed and torque versus stock. Um, they offer a complete range of DC controllers. They are 440 amp controllers and 600 amp controllers. They're safe to use with a stock motor, direct replacement, plug and play. Um, the 600 amp and the 400 amp controller, they're the exact same controller. The only thing that varies is the wiring harness. When it comes to looking at the difference in a 400 amp and a 600 amp controller, your biggest difference is torque. If both controllers will reach the same top speed, the main difference is how quick you get there. Now, how easy are these to install? Extremely easy. You snatch the stock controller off, throw it in the trash can, mount your Navitas, everything's plug and play, and you're ready to go. After everything is mounted and installed, you can download their app, which is, it works on iPhone and Android, install the app, Register the controller, connect to it, make a few user setting changes, and you're ready to go. Sounds super simple. We'll talk about the app in a minute. But first, let's talk about the kit that you brought with you. What do you have here? Okay, so here I have a 600 amp, 5 kilowatt AC conversion kit. Navitas also makes this kit in a 440 amp, 4 kilowatt version. Um, straight out the box, this kit bolts right in. You replace your stock controller, your stock motor. Everything mounts right up, plug and play. Straight out the box, you'll see 25 miles an hour and increased torque. Performance can be increased if the user make a few setting changes in the app, which we'll discuss later. Yeah, and, and so I know most golf carts are DC. What are the advantages of an AC motor? The reason that you'd want to go to an AC is they're more efficient. They run cooler temperatures on the motor. An AC motor is completely brushless, so you do not get that brush contact and brush wear on the motor. An AC kit also has a higher RPM through the whole speed curve. So it's quicker and it's more reliable. Yes, absolutely. I love it. And one thing I really love about this is the controller that Navitas has. Tell me about that thing. Okay, so Navitas has an on-the-fly programmer that will plug directly into their AC and DC controllers. With this programmer, you can adjust your speed and your acceleration. A lot of people, when they, when they want to increase the runtime on the golf cart, they will slow acceleration and speed down with their foot. On a DC cart, if you back off of the pedal, you can build heat faster. With the on-the-fly programmer, if you adjust the speed, it actually changes the mapping in the controller, and therefore the system will not run hot or get warm. So it's safer for the motor, it'll increase longevity, it'll make the motor more reliable. That's amazing, and you mentioned the app. That in conjunction with this controller can really make a lot of changes and make performance even better. Absolutely. When it comes to the app, you can control your RPM, speed settings, tire size, gear size. Everything is adjustable based on changes that you make to the golf cart. So you no longer need a computer. You go straight to your iPhone or Droid device. And now the app and the controller, both are about performance, but they're also about safety. What are some of the things built into the controller for safety? Yes, so when it comes to the app itself, they have a key lockout where you can completely shut the car down. No one can drive it. When it comes to the actual on-the-fly programmer, it has a key lock itself on it where you can turn your speeds down and lock the box. So if you have children that are gonna drive the cart, you can reduce the cart from 25 miles an hour out the box down to 10 miles an hour and lock it. Amazing. Now you needed all this performance to run something like this. Tell me about this giant golf cart behind me that Golf Carts Modified made. Yeah, so what we have here is, you know, this is the extreme version and this is the, the calmer version, but this kit performs well on a stock golf cart too. Um, when it comes to wheels and tires, if you're going with a 23 inch tire or bigger, we highly recommend the Navitas AC conversion kit due to the more torque at higher RPM ranges. 
Now, when I think of golf carts, I think of a golf course, but this is a, an ever expanding market. How many folks are using golf carts outside of a golf course in, in the neighborhood and that sort of thing? Yeah, so at this point, the, the personal vehicle market for golf carts has increased to 60% of the whole market. So it's slowly, the, the golf cart personal vehicle market is increasing and the golf course market is starting to decrease a little bit. So everyone is, are using these to travel the neighborhoods, get to the golf course, grocery shop, everyone's using golf carts now. We're gonna take this one for a spin and I'm sure after that, I'm gonna want one to go to the grocery store myself. Perfect. Now, Corey, you're one of the other owners at Golf Carts Modified. Why did you wanna show me the Navita system on this cart? This cart is much more mild than the big cart. If this is what your standard end user would end up with, something along this line. So the performance should be greatly showcased on this one. Well, it should be. We don't know because this is a brand new golf cart. We just put the Navita system brand in. New. All right, let's give it a run, see what happens. Here we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> It's incredible. It's hard to believe. Oh my gosh. Well, if you want performance like this on your golf cart at home, you've got to check them out. Check out Navitas on their website. Thanks for coming in, Corey. We'll be right back with more Performance TV presented by Topcoat right after this. Okay, Performance TV fans, here's a fast fact for you. 329 million people live in the United States, and about 88% of those people own cars. That's second only to Italy, where 89% own cars. The rest of the world is in stark contrast. Car ownership averages only 35% the world over. Keep it right here for more Performance TV. Performance TV presented by Topcoat is brought to you by rockauto.com. All the parts your car will ever need. MGP caliper covers. Enhance your wheel appearance with MGP brake caliper covers. NH Oil Undercoating, the official oil-based rust prevention system. LSX Innovations, the next generation of LS Swap integrations. And by Top Coat, the best coatings in the world. You are riding along with Performance TV presented by Top Coat. I tell you, if you are looking for an entire race car, or a street rod, or just a chassis, or maybe some components for your car, the place you're gonna wanna look at is S&W Performance Group. You can check them out on the web, and of course, they have a beautiful catalog they will send along to you. Now, they have great tech support, and we'll talk about that in a second, but if you look in their catalog, over 2,800 make and model style listings for roll bars and for roll cages alone, so infinite possibilities, and it can be on your street rod, and your race car, as I said, domestic and import cars, trucks, Jeeps, SUVs, and 4x4s, they've got all kinds of stuff. They'll also make custom cages for specialty vehicles or custom fitment. So if you've got something that you want to change on your car, don't worry about it. You can make that change with them. They've got an engineering staff that can help you out. Available styles. If you want to start simple, something small for your street rod, you've got four-point weld-in street bars. Now, by the way, everything they have welds in, it doesn't bolt in. So if you're not a welder, you'll need someone to assemble it. And of course, they have instructions that they'll send you, and those are easy to follow as well. But as I said, four-point weld-in street bars, you can start with that. And if you want to upgrade from there, you can go on to an eight-point. And the cool thing about it is you can leave all of that in the car. So if you have a four-point street bar and you want to upgrade to the eight-point weld-in, guess what? You can just add on to it. You can do the same thing if you want to go full race mode. And you can go to a 10-point weld-in roll cage as well. And whatever the look or material you're going for, they have EWS, DOM, and chromoly tubing, and you can get the tubing of your choice from all kinds of upgrades and conversions as well. If you're gonna go SCCA racing, they've got stuff you can use super stock. If you wanna go drag racing or a sportsman, even if you're racing a funny car, alcohol or nitro funny car, S&W can make a cage for you. They can make an entire chassis for you as well. If you wanna customize it a little bit, you can get window nets and window net release kits. Also switch mounts for your dashboard or helmet hook, which comes in handy if you're a drag racer and you're sitting there in the staging lanes for a long time, you're gonna want that helmet hook. Camera mounts, of course, everybody runs a GoPro camera on their race car, so a camera mount is gonna be really important for you in a lot of cases. And they have a full machine shop, so anything you want, they can do it there at S&W. They've got water jet cutting, and they can also make a 3D printout of something that you wanna to try to prototype as well. Now, I mentioned their tech support, it's great. All of their sales and marketing people are racers. 
So they're not going to recommend anything for your car that they wouldn't put on their car. And these are all tried and tested. A lot of their stuff is tested on their race cars. So you know you're getting a great product. And the great thing is, too, if you call up and you want some tech support, they're going to know what they're talking about. They're going to be able to recommend changes for your vehicle or modifications you want to make. And they might have a suggestion for a material as well because they've done it. They're racers, and that's the same way this family has been for 60 years. All of the roll bars and roll cages are designed to meet and exceed NHRA and IHRA and most major road race and off-road organization specs. But you got to make sure that you install it in accordance with their guidelines and their rules. So be sure you check out the instructions and you check out the rule book to make sure you're doing it right. And have a pro help you if you need to. Everything is also designed to comfortably fit within your stock interior. So if you've got a car like this Fox Body Mustang, it's going to fit with the interior and you're not going to have to make any modifications to the car. Now, if you want something tailor fit, then the team will bend a custom cage to your specifications. So it's really a full service group there at SW Performance Group. Now here in our studio, we have a Fox Body Mustang roll bar kit, and it's actually one of the most popular products that they sell in their catalog. Now this one, of course, we have mocked up. You can see we've sort of taped it together just to show you how it would come together. This, of course, would be welded, and you can have it welded from them, or you can have it sent just as individual pipe, and you can weld it yourself. Any level from race car all the way down to just pipe, they can do it for you. Whatever level you want it finished to, they can do it for you. It's s and Performance Group. You can check them out at SWRaceCars.com, and of course, you can order your parts straight from there, or you can get one of these beautiful catalogs sent to your home. Be sure to check them out. If you're wanting to do anything in the racing world, SW Performance is the way to go. We'll be right back with more Performance TV presented by Top Coat right after this. You're tuned in to Performance TV, so we know you love cars. So do most Americans. In 2018, the United States had a population of around 330 million people. And that same year, Americans owned a reported 270 million motor vehicles. We'll have more ways you can improve your car coming up right after this. Keep it locked on Performance TV. TV coming from Borla Commerce Park. Welcome back to Performance TV presented by Top Coat. You know, we've done a lot of cool stuff through the years here in the studio, and we'd like to take you on a walk down memory lane. Here's one of our more popular segments. We love our cars and spend a lot of time cleaning them and maintaining them, like this awesome pony car, the Ford Mustang, or these really cool Harley-Davidson motorcycles. When you go out on the weekend, you want to look great. Even your work truck, it represents you. You want it to be top notch. Well, Scott is here from Top Coat, going to show us a great way to clean and maintain our vehicles. Scott, tell us a little bit about your company. Well, Top Coat is a really unique product. Um, what's nice about the Top Coat products, and F11 in particular, is that it's the very first multi use, multi application coating on the market. Literally, we're, you can do anything with this product, as I'm going to demonstrate. So, here over here, we'll do some plastic, glass, and some of this paint and uh, just demonstrate just how easy this is. Show us what you got and I immediately take notice to the fact we're using the same product on all these surfaces. Absolutely, so it's literally as simple as this, just a quick spray, you don't need a lot of the product and of course you always want great microfiber towels like ours that are, have been designed to do just this, but you spray and you start buffing with your very first microfiber towel of course, right? Well then, you always want to take and follow up with your dry microfiber towel to your final buff because what you want to do is you want to push that sealer, you know, because it is an actual sealer, into the pericity of that substrate. That's going to allow it to cure better, it's going to allow your reflectivity, and also your enhancements of all of these different materials. So literally, we just went from paint to plastics, now we're working on glass. The beauty with the glass is extremely hydrophobic properties. So, you know, you're going down the street, you're going to notice how fast that, the, the water just you know, zips right off of that windshield, uh, and all glass for that matter. But you're enhancing everything too as you go. So it just makes it so very versatile and easy. I can't begin to stress to you just how easy this product is. You know, we all work. You know, time is really important today in, in our society, and you want to achieve those professional results, obviously, but we don't have the time. Well, Top Coat will allow that to happen. Well, I can see a difference already. I'm already thinking about less products and bottles in my cabinet. This kind of cool on this F-150. Let's kick it over to Kathy to find out with one of the motorcycles. F11 can be used absolutely anywhere on anything. And Jay, especially here on the bike, you know, start off right with the windshield. The F11 product is going to make a big difference, and it's not going to yellow like some other products may make a windshield. Exactly. It's going to create a ease-release surface on the windshield, 
releasing bugs, dirt, and debris easier. Absolutely. And we can also use it on a dark paint like this. Man, it's really going to make a big difference. Yes. F11 is going to polish, seal, and protect. It's going to increase the depth of image. Right. It really makes the metallic pop out of that. Yeah, it makes it look like you can dive in and go for a swim. It exactly. just, it really deepens it. And after 24 hours, it, it'll get even a richer gloss shine. What about our footboards? It will rejuvenate all that rubber and make it look nearly new again. You know, and a lot of times people will have so many different products they're using. Like, got to get this to do the chrome. Got to get this to do the, the black stuff, which we don't have to worry about anywhere where this product goes because it's not leaving any type of white residue. Exactly. We can use it on anything. Boy, this is going to save a lot of time on detailing and more time for riding. I like this. Exactly. You're going to use it on your all chrome, your engine, all your emblems, your decals, even your leather. It'll make the leather right more back. subtle. To the saddlebag. Polish, seal, and protect it. You're going to polish this. all your ornamental leather at the same time. Look at this. Check this out. Look at the line that we can see right there. Makes a whole big difference. Now, when we come over here to our newer bike, Jay, what about the spokes? It works great on the spokes, even the wheel, and even your tire for that matter. You got to remember this product is water based, no VOCs, it's eco friendly, and uh, you know what, Jay? This bike has the denim paint on it, which is a really popular paint right now. Can we use this on? Top that? Road is one of the only products you can use on those denim finishes. It will not increase the shine only given its natural luster. Wow. You can use this product on anything you see on this bike, cutting down on your detail time, more time to ride, and more time to have fun. And you know what? Joe is going to show us how you can take this product and use it on the inside of your vehicle. Mike is also in the house here from Top Coat. Mike, we're moving on to some other materials on our convertible Mustang. That's right. Not only does F11 work on the paint and plastic, it'll work on rubber and also convertible tops. It looks great. Now, cars come with a lot of plastic aerodynamic pieces like this Mustang down low. Plastic we've already treated and we can see the difference. We did. We pre-treated this just to show the difference. But if you open the door and look at how this dirty mess down here, the plastic is just like hammered. It's like it's really dirty. So you literally can take F11, spray right over this, even this Mustang emblem, including the paint too, and wipe all this clean. And not only will it clean it, it will protect it, it'll encapsulate that dirt, making it easy to remove. It'll protect it and restore it back to brand new looking. Now that's counterintuitive in that there was dirt on there. You didn't wipe the dirt off before you applied the F11. Right. When you spray F11 onto dirt in a surface, it encapsulates the dirt and it's microscopic, gets between the dirt and the surface and makes it where the dirt will not adhere. Makes it easy to, to wipe right off. We already did the cowl. That worked out great. A lot of great stuff. I'm blown away. Tell us where we can find out more. You can find out more at our website at topcoat.tv. Dot TV. That is very important. Thank you guys for coming in. Blows my mind. One product, so many different materials. For more Performance TV, stick around. We'll be back after this. It's time once again to check your automotive IQ here on Performance TV. The first automatic transmission was invented by Canadian steam engineer Alfred Munro. Did Munro do it in 1882, 1903, 1921, or 1930? The correct answer is 1921. It took another 19 years for the automatic transmission to make it into a production car. Performance TV, presented by Top Coat, is brought to you by Stage 8 Fasteners, home of the world's best locking header bolt. Locking kits now available for all turbo applications. Go to stage8.com. Custom Auto Sound, the originator of classic car OEM through radio since 1977. American Off Roads, transform the way you shop with AmericanOffRoads.com. Engine Swap Supply, tackle your projects with confidence. And by Magic Creeper, the most versatile creeper ever. Welcome back to Performance TV presented by Top Coat. Now this one's backed by popular demand. We hope you enjoy it. One of the coolest, most versatile products we've had a chance to learn about here on Performance TV has been the Magic Creeper. And Brittany, it's a people creeper. It's a parts creeper. I mean, you can just use all kinds of things on this, but you guys have added something else to your line, and that is a whole emergency kit. 
Yes, Kathy. So the Magic Creeper is a wheelless mechanics creeper, and what we've done is we've added the creeper to your standard emergency kit so that you can put it in your car, truck, motor home, take it with you in the case of an emergency. You know, and, and if you want, it, you can get the kit. Say you already have a Magic Creeper, mm -hmm. and you just want to get the kit, you can do that. You've set it up a couple of different ways. You just want to get the bag for the kit. But it, it's really cool to have one of these in all of your vehicles because they're extremely lightweight, and if you need to use them alongside of the road or whatever, Hey, it's going to protect you getting on the ground. That's right, and it works on any surface, Kathy. So if you're in the dirt, gravel, grass, anywhere except underwater. Anywhere. But if you do get this wet or something happens or you might get some oil on it or whatever, how do you clean this? So it has a protective outer coating, so it's oil and water resistant. So if you do get a little bit of oil on it, some simple green or degreaser works great to clean it up. Perfect. But we talk about moving people around. How about moving very heavy parts? And this is probably over, you know, 300 pounds. But I bet you're going to be able to move that right along, Brittany. Let's give it a shot. All right, show us how it's done. And, you know, whether you need to put something in the back of a vehicle or you've got whatever, you can just move it right along that simple with the Magic Creeper. But what's it like to be outside in the gravel or whatever and get under a vehicle? Well, Joe's going to show us how. So we're stuck on the side of the road, and it's raining, and also very cold. Fortunately, we've got the Magic Creeper. We're going to be able to get under our vehicle and check out what's going on. Plus, we've got the great safety kit so that we can take care of any challenge that hits us on the side of the road. Now, one thing that's very important is to keep this rolled up. That keeps it flat so you can roll it out just like this. And what you're going to want to do is just sit right on the edge, and this will keep you clean because you don't move. The Creeper moves. Now I'm under here just like that and I can go left and I can go right and easily move around whereas if I had a regular creeper there's no way I'm getting under this vehicle. That's what makes it better. It's easy to clean. If you get oil on it you can use degreaser. It is actually a very cool product and the fact that I can get way under here is also very good. It's as simple as that. I love the product. I love what it does. And if you love it too, check out magiccreeper.com. Well, thanks once again for tuning in to Performance TV. We're ready to get up out of here for this episode. There's more to come next week, though. If you can't wait that long, why not check out our Facebook page or look us up on YouTube. If you have a product you'd like to see featured on Performance TV, be sure to email jeff at masterstv.com. Until next time, we will see you.